In this video I have cotan squared theta times cosecant squared theta minus cotan squared theta and we will equal to cotan to the power of 4 theta. So what we have here, we have cosine theta divided by sine theta and here we have 1 over sine theta squared I just converted cosecant to 1 over sine and cotan to cosine divided by sine cotan again I can write it as cosine divided by sine so I will have cosine squared theta sine squared theta times 1 over sine squared theta minus cosine squared theta divided by sine squared theta <coughs> Here we have multiplication, so it will be sine to the power of 4 theta cosine squared theta minus sine squared theta, and here we have cosine squared theta. So in order to have this subtraction, we need to have the same denominator, so I will write sine to the power of 4 theta cosine squared theta minus cosine squared theta sine square theta so then I factor cosine square theta will be 1 minus sine square theta and here in denominator I write sine to the power of 4 theta 1 minus sine square theta is the same as cosine square theta so it's going to be cosine square theta multiplied by cosine square theta so it will be cosine to the power of 4 theta divided by sine to the power of 4 theta. And that will be equal to cotan to the power of 4 theta. 